It's a chilly autumn morning here in Swaziland. It rained all night. The grass is wet and lush. But as in the past three years, the rains have come too late again. Months of drought preceded the rains. The dry season has destroyed this farmer's crop of the staple, corn. Again this year there is no harvest. Everything is dry. What will we eat? I don't know what to do. Everything is dead. Most of Swaziland's people live in the rural areas. In this village, at least, they can draw water out of a well. Constance Gina prepares a meal for her family of seven on an open fire. Rural life is hard. We haven't got an oven in our kitchen, no electricity, and no refrigerator. But recently, the village acquired a luxury item. The communal building, just a hundred meters away from Constance's hut, now has a solar-powered fridge. Cold milk and fresh meat were very rare here before its arrival. But only a few people here have anything to put in the fridge. A third of the population has no work. The fridges are made by the Palfridge Company, located in the trading town of Manzini.